What's up guys, Ryan back again. I'm gonna show you guys a little advice of how to do the conquest. So as you guys can see here, we kind of built ourselves up to the north and also the west coast. And what I really focus on in the beginning is just kind of building a little wall here. So we're gonna reinforce our little wall and we're gonna put all twos and just leave ones in the middle because those can't get attacked. And we've kind of built around our base, but we're not focused on that. So now that we have our reinforcement there we're gonna continue to build up here just take as many spots as you can and if this is uh, kind of like risk it really helps to be attacking with four pieces or more gives you a big advantage as you guys can see we just got attacked there so with our next uh, phase we're gonna have to put some reinforcements and kind of build back our wall but that's what I would focus on at the beginning guys just kind of build around and don't really move too far to the west at too fast just continue to move slowly we're gonna go ahead and attack and just build back here so we're gonna take all these spots back and just build back our wall as Colorado is attacking us again man it can get kind of annoying with them taking you out but just continue to be patient and continue to build your little wall around your pieces and go ahead and just skip the steel fans phase every time it doesn't really help unless you want to make it a little bit longer of a process or if it's a little bit hard for you playing the games but continue to do that and when you're building up your pieces try to attack the main bases with at least a four to one ratio i believe that lets you play on rookie so that's my little strategy here for the beginning i'm going to show you guys a few more clips of how i finished it off and i'll meet you guys for the outro so as you guys can see we continue to move off to the west coast here and remember that four to one ratio is big you want to continue to attack with at least four pieces if you're going against a one so we continue to move here and what i would really recommend is to continue to move to the west coast first so i'm showing you guys this clip here where i kind of messed up took a lot longer and i ended up kind of continuing to move south but man, just take over that west coast, it's a lot better. So as you guys can see here, I was kind of building up a wall there to the south, but I'm getting attacked on two different fronts, which is really not what you want. want you want to have all your pieces defending kind of one area. So here, we're definitely making a mistake. And in the next clip, I'm going to show you of where I moved kind of more off to the west coast. But if you are going to attack like this, what I would really recommend is kind of moving in twos. So you always have two spaces bases next to each other because as you guys can see there we continue to get attacked so this is really what you want to do take over that whole west coast then just continue to move off to the east and with this one man i got lucky because the blue jays took over the east coast and they're way worse of a team to play than like the yankees or the red sox let's say so definitely got lucky on that one but continue to move through play all the games and remember that four to one ratio so you can play the games on rookie but yeah guys we continue to just beast it play all these games and remember the rewards are in a video down below in the link in the description definitely check that out but i'm going to run through all the different rewards you get here remember the corners of the map give you extra special packs there's some hidden rewards throughout the map go to the corners try to find those thanks for joining man let's jump back to the live video 3800 uh, experience and that is what we we're looking for manifest destiny conquer every territory on the map and we get a 10 pack bundle to upgrade our team should be getting a few other things as well yep another pack there and ty cobb the 88 rated diamond i don't believe we're gonna bring him into this series but let me know in the comments remember this is pack pulled only so i don't really think this necessarily uh is a pack pull but it's definitely a player i'm going to use on my account and I think I'm going to do uh, this again at some point because, man, that was kind of a lot of fun and addicting. It did take quite a while, but, you know, just do it through uh, throughout the day whenever you can. And, yeah, man, so we got 300 points in the first inning program. We finished up Conquest. We have Ty Cobb in our team. Let's take a look at his card real quick. So this Ty Cobb, I don't believe you can sell it. Yeah, you definitely can't. He's on the Oakland A's as a 40-year-old. Still a good hitter. 
but defensively not as good not as fast as he once was thank you so much for joining this video hopefully it did help you out drop a like if it did subscribe down below and meet me in the comments i really think that they should be coming out with a new map soon and i can do some more guides for these ones as well keith hernandez i would really recommend but yeah and uh also check out my link for the video down below where i opened up the rewards as part of my pack only series so check out that man good to be back on youtube see you soon